Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to Beat the All right, you guys, I hope you guys are doing great this evening, or should I say this morning? Um, today I made some, actually these are some leftover, I'm gonna call this one, Sea Garden Tots. <laughs> As you probably can figure it out, yes. It consists of, again, you guys, if you're new to my channel, welcome aboard. Everything I consume is vegan. And yes, I do use normal words to describe my food. So do not get offended or triggered, all right? So we have some fish and crab all up in here. Yeah, but these are not just any old fish or crab. Like I stated before, everything here is plant-based, all right? We also got some samosas from this company, y'all. Go and check them out. I picked this up from, I don't remember where. It's probably Whole Foods. Either Whole Foods or Fred Meyer. Fred Meyer is your typical um, Kroger. Samosa came with chutney dipping sauce, which is not my favorite, but whatever, all right? I also squiggled some sriracha for some heat. But first, <sighs> Let's sue this dry throat. <sighs> All right, you guys, let's begin. You get the first bite. I don't know if you like chutney, but go ahead and try it anyway. Go ahead. The fillings in here is peas and potatoes. What you think? Oh. Mm. These have been air fried. <clears throat> Shockingly, this chutney is not bad. I guess it all depends who makes the chutney, right? Wow, this is actually good. Wow. Mm -hmm. All right, okay. Oh my goodness. You know what, yeah. This one is good. This chutney right here that came with that pack. The other company I had, it came with chutney and it tastes like toothpaste to me. This one is perfect. This one's really good. Come through chutney, come through. Yeah, it's not too minty, you know, like Colgate, the toothpaste. It's not, it's not like that. It doesn't taste like toothpaste, but you do taste the mint. Just not too minty. Get into that. Oh yeah. So the crab and fish you guys I I use are the the company called Cardine. Cardine. Am I saying it right? Probably. What I did was I air fried them both, and then I chopped them up, and then sprinkled them on top. See right here. This one's a crab cake. Mm -mm. I did the same thing with the fish. 
and I make some sauce. Go ahead, take a bite. So good. I have a lot of stuff going on in here. All right. Wow. Actually, I have two hot sauces going on in here. I have the nuclear fire sauce. I add it into my sauce. And then, as you can see, the drizzles, those are the, the, uh, those are the um, sriracha. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Tangy, sweet. Almost, yeah, it's not that sweet. It's, yeah, there's some sweet to it, but it's not sweet. It's a little sweet. And spicy and sour. As you guys probably already heard, <clears throat> the COVID-19 um, vaccine is out. Are you going to take it? That's the question. <laughs> hmm. Oh, excuse me. Okay. One thing about me that you guys probably don't know, or probably don't even care, <laughs> and why am I sharing it, is that I don't do any vaccines. Um, no longer. 
It's just something about my little conspiracy theory hat. My conspiracy mind. But I've stopped taking the flu vaccine since I was a teenager. Preteen. So. Just do you, all right? Ooh, excuse me. Ooh. Ooh. If you take vaccines, more power to ya. It's just not for me. You guys, I really think my mic is going out. <clears throat> I have two sets of mics. One of each. That I use on my videos, you guys. I do have a lavender, what's it called, lavier? Lapel, lavender. You know what I mean, that little mic. Lavender. or lapel mic we'll call it a pail okay i had one it's in a drawer i use that whenever i can but right now i have two two different mics i don't know i don't know what's going on all of a sudden it's just acting funny whatever probably need a, a new mic I had it for over two years now, so it's not, I don't know. Mike shouldn't, should last longer than that. One of them I use for my ASMR channel, and the other one is just a general mic. After this, y'all, I'm gonna go run. Run the course, not the streets, the golf course. <laughs> Every time I eat a lot of carbs, I'm motivated to get out. Like, I need to do something physical. <clears throat> this is good. I think, oh, okay, now I know why it tastes good to chutney. Tamarind, there's tamarind and mint in this chutney. I think the other chutney that I've had previous, I think they just only had mint, mint only. Whatever, you gotta add tamarind. <laughs> That's my new thing now. If they if they offer chutney to me when I order my Indian food, I'm gonna ask them. Do they have tamarind in it? If not, I don't want it. The 
they'll probably be like, get your lazy ass out of here. <laughs> we'll make the chutney how we make it. That is good. Oh my goodness. All right, that is it. I want to thank you guys so much for having a brunch with me. Don't forget, give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little bell so you can get notified when I upload a new video. Chit, what's it called? Chit chit chu. You know the um, Ethiopian neck dance? What is it called? Chikra? Chikra. If you know what I'm talking about, leave it down below. Anyhow, I watched a, a video on it yesterday. It was very interesting. Anyhow, see you guys tomorrow. Ofatu. You can go. Bye. <laughs>